fellows really developed an incredible bond. They were already calling each other a family. But with the introduction of the Unreasonable Village Fund, when there's actually $150,000 at stake, there's real money here, is really going to test that bond. And the question is, are they going to compete against each other, or are they going to compete against failure? It's a very fine line between making it a competition and making it a, a collaboration. And the initial reaction was probably more on the it's a competition side of things. It took a little bit of time to realize that it's much more about collaboration. 25 brilliant entrepreneurs working on ventures in 17 countries and hailing from six continents will convene this summer in Boulder. Living under the same roof and sharing the same meals for 10 weeks, they have convened in Boulder this summer for one reason, to create ventures that future generations will remember as having changed the world. Ventures that will effectively address a social or environmental need, that are financially self-sustaining, and that will ultimately scale to meet the needs of at least one million people. It's no big deal. When we first introduced Village Capital, um, we introduced it as an experiment. That's what it is. These entrepreneurs are deciding who amongst each other will receive the $75,000. But what's just as interesting is they're selecting how. They're creating the process by which they select one another. It's just, it's just